Good morning, dear students. Today we will do maths of class fifth. We will do question number one and question number two of exercise seven point five. So let's start. Question number one of exercise seven point five is give an example of the following from the surroundings. The first one is cuboid. Dear students, we all have almiras at our homes. These almiras are of the shape of a cuboid. So the example of cuboid is almira. The next one is cube. Its example is a dice. We all have seen dice in the Ludo game. Dear students, this dice is of the shape of a cube. Now the next one is cone. So example of cone is an ice cream cone. Dear students, we all have eaten ice cream by putting it into a cone. This cone is of the shape of a cone. The next one is cylinder. Dear students, the example of cylinder is gas cylinder that we use at our homes. Now, we will do question number 2 of exercise 7.5. The question is, which of the following can form cubes? Draw them on paper and find answers. Dear students, we have drawn the picture given in part A on a paper like this. This net contains six boxes. All the six boxes are of equal size. We will fold these boxes to make a 3D shape from this 2D shape. We will fold the boxes of this net like this and try to make a 3D shape. So by folding these boxes, we have come out with this type of a 3D shape. Now this 3D shape has 6 faces. All the 6 faces are of equal size. So we have come out with which type of a shape? Yes. Dear kids, this is a cube. Now let's move on to part B. We have drawn the picture given in part B on a paper like this. This net contains 6 boxes. All the boxes are of equal size. Dear students, by folding these boxes, we tried to make a cube but could not make it. Now let's move on to Part number C of this question, we have drawn the picture given in this part on a paper like this. This net contains six boxes. All the boxes are of equal size. Now we will fold these boxes to make a 3D shape. The shape which we have made is that of a cube because it contains six faces. And all these faces are of equal size. So, we have made a cube. Now, let's move on to part number D. Here, we have a net containing six boxes. All these six boxes are of equal size. Now, let's fold these boxes to make a 3D shape. Yes, kids. We have made a 3D shape and this shape contains 6 faces. All of them are of equal size. So this is a cube. Now let's move on to the next part. We have drawn this figure on a paper like this. This net contains 5 boxes. These 5 boxes cannot make a cube as a cube has 6 faces. So, these 5 boxes are not enough. Dear students, let's move on to next part. This net contains 6 boxes. Let's fold these boxes to make a 3D shape. We are here with a cube. As it contains 6 faces and all the faces are of equal size. Now kids, let's move on to the next part. Here. We have drawn the shape given in this part on a paper like this. This contains 8 boxes. 
Dear students, these eight boxes cannot make a cube. So let's move on to the next one. This net contains five boxes. Now five boxes are not enough to make a cube. So these boxes cannot make a cube as it requires six boxes to make a cube. Dear kids, that means part A, part C, part D and part F. These figures make cubes. Now dear students, for homework, practice question number 1 and question number 2 of exercise 7.5. Thank you so much.